Good morning, and thank you for joining me, Coach Mike, on your Monday morning. The day 56 men sign their name on a document to rid themselves of tyranny and British rule and create a free nation that we enjoy today. July 4th, 1776 was that day. As an important as a date that is, there was another date that was just as important. March 5th, 1770, British soldiers were marching down the streets of Boston. And the colonials and the inhabitants were obviously outraged with their presence. And they made it very well known to the point they started throwing slurs and actually rocks at these British soldiers. To which led to the commander finally saying, fix bayonets, charge. And unfortunately, many people died that day. And that news spread to two particular gentlemen that were outraged. And those gentlemen were Samuel Adams and John Hancock. And then that moment, they made a decision to free themselves of the tyranny of the British rule. They had this desire for a free nation. They had the courage to speak up. But they realized they couldn't do it alone. So they reached out to all the leaders of the other colonies and created a mastermind group to start the process and the planning to get rid of the British to where they finally created what they call the Continental Congress, of which all these men got together and organized their plan and, and their thinking to create that eventually, the independence, the Declaration of Independence. Now, there was a lot of ingredients to going up to that. It was courage to make the decision, desire for a free nation, faith that they were gonna pursue and follow their plans and get what they eventually want. Persistence, courage, all the ingredients it takes to be also successful in business. So when those men sat down that day, July 4th, 1776, and all signed their name on the document, it was a life or death decision because they knew if they were gonna go to war with Britain, which was certainly to happen when they signed that document, that if they lost that war, they would all be shipped back to Britain to be hanged for treason. And those are the same decisions our young men and women make each and every day that are serving and fighting for the freedom of our country. So as you celebrate this Thursday, as you're having your hot dogs and hamburgers and you're at the beach and on your boat and having a whole bunch of fun and drinking some cold ones, realize the ingredients it took to deliver that day for us. Desire, courage, faith, masterminding, organized planning, and most important, decision and persistence. And that's the same ingredient it takes to be successful in business and in life. So on this day, celebrate, enjoy, but most importantly, Remember the ingredients that gave you this day. I want to thank you for joining me, Coach Michael, on your Monday morning. I want to wish you a happy 4th of July. See you next Monday.